hey guys welcome back to my channel it has been such a long time since i have actually filmed a video it's been about a few months i think the last video I posted was back in february or march and now it is almost end of november i don't know i basically just wanted to come back here on youtube part time and still continue working on my channel because right now i do feel inspired to do some videos for you guys i just want to say that yeah because of you know covid um none of us have been really going outside wearing much makeup uh, i have not worn much makeup in a very long time i mean the most i do is my eyes because we do have to wear our mask because when you're wearing a mask you know all the makeup kind of gets messed up anyway uh, it all comes off on the mask um, so to me it's where it's kind of pointless to wear makeup underneath the mask and also I just wanted to take a break from YouTube because again there's a lot going on in the world and I just didn't feel inspired enough to make makeup videos so yeah i just wanted to film a good old sephora haul video for you guys today uh before i get started just a couple of things i'm not filming in my usual studio <clears throat> i'm filming at my parents house so that's why the setup is a little bit different also the lighting is just natural lighting um so i'm just trying this setup out to see if this works or not so this is my sephora box right here and we'll get started Okay guys, so the first item I have here is this Kiehl's Mini Mask Sampler Set. The masks in here are Rare Earth Deep Pores, so Purify Mask, Soothing Mask, Hydrating Mask, and a Firming Mask. For those of you who are looking for good skincare items, Kiehl's is a great brand, so I do recommend you guys to check out this product. The next item I have is this Caudalie Vino Pure a purifying gel cleanser and it's just a normal gel cleanser um, I believe it has some some beads in it which is great for you know combination skin I have combination skin so I thought I would give this a try I've never tried this before the next item I have is this pharmacy daily greens oil free moisturizer so this is a moisturizer that I really love anyway and that bottle is almost finishing so I got a backup of this so this is a product that I'd really recommend you guys to try out if you have normal to combination skin so the next item here on this list is this Dermalogica trio which comes with a pre-cleanse a special cleansing gel and a daily microfoliant I have loved Dermalogica for many years I've used many of their products before so I just got this uh, cute little trio set for traveling these are products that i do swear by so especially i love the cleansing gel it is so mild and it is great great product for even those of you who have sensitive skin so if you guys have never tried out dermalogica i would say pick up the set so that way you guys can try it and then you can go buy the bigger bottles that they provide it looks like it is getting darker outside but let's try to finish this video <laughs> The next thing I have here is this cute little stocking set right here. And this is from Caudalie and you know this is their trio of hand creams. So there are three hand creams. So this year we are in definite need of good hand creams because you know we are washing our hands more often using way too much hand sanitizer. So my hands do tend to get dry from time to time. So I've been using a lot of hand moisturizer. And then, you know, if you do want to give the hand cream to someone else, then this is a great idea. So one thing that I usually pick up every year during the Sephora sale are these Sephora masks right here. This is a set of six masks. There's a coconut face mask, grapefruit mask, matcha tea, spirulina, pineapple, and pomegranate. I love Sephora masks as well. So this is great if you want to try out masks from Sephora. So every year I wait for the sale so that I can buy the set. Um, and they have some new masks in here I believe this year. So I'm excited to try them out. So that's all I had in terms of skincare. Now we're going to move on to a few makeup items that I picked up. I wanted to really try out Rare Beauty by Selena Gomez. I have tried her Lip Souffle. This one is in Fearless and it is... The lip shade that I'm wearing right now it is very comfortable to wear on the lips yeah I've been obsessed with this uh, lip souffle so I got another color in the shade heroic so look how pretty of a pink this is I haven't worn a pink like this in a long time uh, so I'm excited to try this out but the formula feels the same which is great you know there's so much makeup out there that we don't need you know more makeup and more brands but if 
a new brand does come out and they do have good performance um, and good reviews then I am excited to try them out that's why I also got these soft pinch liquid blushes I usually love cream blushes and liquid blushes so these are the two shades that I picked up this one is called love and this one is called grapefruit again this looks uh, quite daring but I'm sure when you blend it out it will look just absolutely beautiful so I do love a lot of Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks um, so I ran out of one of her lipsticks and so I just bought a little refill for uh, hot lips it was Viva La Vergara I don't need to repurchase the whole tube of lipstick you know this is great so this is the color right here it's really beautiful in an everyday shade. Okay guys, so the last item I bought is a perfume. This is an impulse purchase. I wanted to get this for the longest time. This is a Chloe perfume. So this comes in a beautiful little bottle. It is one of the perfumes that sells quite a bit. Um, it's a favorite of a lot of people. So this is one of the original Chloe perfumes. And it's a very feminine perfume. And it smells great. So my purchases now are totally different. Mostly geared towards skincare. Um, like I said, because I bought very few makeup items this year, so I thought, you know what, why not treat myself to this perfume that I've been wanting for a very, very long time. So I hope you guys have had some fun uh, watching this Sephora haul video. Again, not a lot of items this time, but they're mostly geared towards things that I really, really need. And just another comment that, you know, COVID is still out there and we are still not out of this pandemic yet. Be safe out there this Christmas season and... Um, if you have to go somewhere to wear a mask, you know, that is very essential. So I hope you guys enjoyed this whole video. If you did, make sure to hit the like button, share, subscribe to my channel so that I can continue to make more videos, you know, off and on. And I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you are. And I'll see you.